Religious liberty is important for Christians, as it's really important for everyone, but certainly for Christians, the freedom to preach the gospel has got to be right up at the top. Of course, the gospel is often preached and effectively preached where there, are, there isn't Christian liberty, uh, religious liberty, but where there is liberty, uh, the freedom, the places you can go, the public events, the numbers of people who can be reached, the fact that you don't have to be giving attention all the time to issues of are we being followed, you know, are police investigating us, are pastors being put into jail, um, is literature being confiscated. Um, those things happen in places where there's not religious liberty. In other places where there has been religious liberty and it's being gradually lost, such as uh, in the United States, uh, it's somewhat of a different issue. We're, we're so accustomed to liberty that sometimes we just take it for granted and we don't do the things that are necessary to keep it. And that's why I think that religious liberty should not be the primary focus of our lives, like Christians have to have rights and we got to claim them all the time. But if somebody isn't paying attention to maintaining and holding on to Christian liberties, the rest of us, and particularly our children and grandchildren, and our churches are going to suffer.